Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lords. I hope that you're having a fantastic day and today I'm actually going to be showing you guys how to do this awesome glitch that you're seeing on screen right now. It's a crazy one. It's probably one of the funnest glitches that I've done in quite some time and uh, yeah, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it and probably the easiest way to do it also. Uh, before we actually get into the video guys, please don't forget to leave a like on the video if you do enjoy it and also subscribe to the channel for more Fortnite glitches, tips, guides, videos, all that kind of stuff including giveaways. I have one planned, a, a pretty big giveaway actually, sometime in the next couple of days for V-Bucks. So please go and subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications and await the channel, uh, I guess, giveaway video. Uh, but anyway, like I said, this glitch is actually going to make you guys be able to skydive all around the map. It's such a weird glitch. I guess it's like a, it's kind of like a, a laggy one, I guess. I'm not too sure exactly how to say this, but it's a very strange glitch. It's kind of difficult to do. I guess the only difficult part is really getting the jump pad itself. And it probably would have been easier to do this while the solid gold game mode was out. But unfortunately, that already finished. So we have to actually get our uh, jump pads ourselves. They're very difficult to find. Like, so difficult to find. It's unbelievable. Uh, but anyway, let's get straight into how to actually do this awesome glitch in Fortnite Battle Royale. Okay, so the first thing you're actually going to want to do, which is obvious, is have yourself a jump pad. This is a necessity, you definitely need the jump pad, and you're also going to need a lot of wood. And the reason for this is because what we're actually going to do is place the jump pad down on a piece of wooden brick or wood brick, metal, whatever you want to do. And what we're actually going to do is find the kind of pyramid type structure that you can actually build with your wooden, uh, I guess, planks. and. As we jump onto the actual pad itself, we're going to very quickly place down the actual pyramid just as we hear the kind of parachute up noise that we hear when we actually jump on the jump pad. Uh, this can actually take a long time to do. It is very difficult, so don't think that you're going to get this in the first couple of tries. As you can see from this clip, I tried it several times and I found it very difficult to do. But the more you keep on practicing, it's more of a like rhythm thing. You just have to kind of get the timing right. The minute that you hear that little like kind of woof, like remember. that is when you place the jump pad down and I want to stress that this does work on Xbox PlayStation and PC you can do it on every console uh, but anyway I'm gonna skip to this little part yeah. here where yeah. actually you can see that I have got myself a jump pad and um, we're right near uh, Pleasant Park we actually went on to win this game which was absolutely insane it was such a great end game I actually got a no scope like pretty much from very far away it was pretty cool um, but anyway as you can see I've got my jump pads in my inventory and what I'm gonna do is just place down a little piece of wooden structure place the jump pad on top of it and like I said the hardest part about this now is basically just getting that rhythm down you have to just constantly jump and jump and jump it gets kind of annoying after a while especially if you're kind of getting pressured by the the, the, the storm coming in and everything it can be really difficult uh, but as you can see I eventually get it and uh, once you actually get it you should see that your character kind of floats for a second in midair and what you want to do is keep your character completely still and you will see that he stays in that little pose that you just got into, the skydiving pose. Now, I do also want to say that sometimes you can do it where it actually messes up. So you will actually get like the skydive animation, but like a couple of seconds later, you'll go back to your feet. And um, what I can say is you've nearly got it. Just keep on trying the exact same thing you're doing. It's just a kind of lucky thing. You know, you have to get lucky with doing it. But I would say... This happens around, like, let's see, one in every 20 times that you try it, I would say. So, you know, don't give up. Keep on trying it. You will eventually get it. And there's no... So there's no really big thing about this. I mean, there's nothing big and huge about this glitch. You can't do anything crazy. About the only thing you can do is hide in a couple of bushes while you're, like, kind of skydiving and just make it look weird and cool. Um, other than that, you don't gain any competitive advantage, which is good. It's just a silly glitch that Epic are going to patch eventually that you can just kind of mess around and show to your friends. Uh, so, yeah, that is pretty much the lowdown on the whole skydiving forever glitch. If you do enjoy the video, guys, like I said, please remember to leave a like. I have a huge V-Bucks giveaway coming up very soon. Subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. Definitely don't miss it. I've also got a couple of videos planned, such as the no, like more backpack space, uh, the streamer's official 
official settings and also a video on the nukes that are coming to the new Fortnite Battle Royale game modes. Please do not miss out on them. You're going to enjoy them, I promise you. Uh, but anyway, that has pretty much been it for me, guys. I hope that you have an awesome day. Enjoy the glitch. Enjoy the new update that comes out tomorrow, the 50v 2020 2020. And uh, yeah, until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.